Live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Chad Evans. Weather from where you live. Well, Juan and Boswell, Mark and Monticello, Candy, Teal up and Chalmers all picking up some soaking rainfall. No, not only last night, but today as well. We're in a bit of a lull right now, a little shower near Frankfurt. But most of the showers and thunderstorms right now are just east of Indianapolis. But a few more still can pop during the overnight hours with this very moist plume coming out of the Gulf and the Pacific. Notice here we are, the red dot right here, that's a WLFI viewing area, but check out the moisture plume coming out of the Pacific right up the Mississippi Valley. And notice the heavy rains lifting out of Mississippi, coming into Tennessee and Southern Kentucky. So some of these are gonna move up into Indiana overnight tonight. And again, we've got a pretty deep tropical flow off the Atlantic as well. So I still wanna keep at least a few scattered showers and thunderstorms in the forecast for tonight, again, coming out of the southwest, the leading edge of the rain is about right here. And as that moves up from the southwest, we could uh, have a few showers around with about 30% coverage overnight tonight. Now, tomorrow, I think the heaviest rainfall will be just southeast of us with the potential of some flash flooding. But at least a few scattered showers and thunderstorms here. Still humid, still tropical. Highs around 80. A lot of clouds mixed with a little sun. Any shower would be early Thursday, then partly cloudy. But as we get into Friday, a very strong jet stream dynamics and a deep trough begins to build out of Canada. And basically that means cold air is coming in from the north and with a pretty strong cold front coming through and a pretty tropical air mass. We've got to watch a severe weather threat. There's a lot of question as to whether it will be in the heart of the WLFI viewing area or just off to our west and our south. So it's either going to be in our area or close by. So this bears a lot of watching for Friday. Pretty potent outbreak possible in the Midwest. And then for Saturday and Sunday, at least a couple showers coming in from the northwest along a secondary cold front. And this will usher in cooler weather for next week. Highs running only mid to upper 60s. Overnight lows near 40 degrees as fall-like weather arrives. So a few scattered showers and storms tonight. Some patchy, dense fog developing after midnight with lows in the 60s. Tomorrow right around 80. Clouds mixed with some sunshine, still muggy, and some scattered showers and thunderstorms just like today. And then for the weekend, again, we'll watch this potential severe weather threat on Friday. A couple showers lingering into Saturday and Sunday, and then much cooler next week with highs running about 65 to 70 degrees. And again, we're getting towards October now. This is pretty normal to have these colder air masses coming in from Canada. It'll be interesting to see if the lower temperatures that we've had this summer continue throughout the winter. Yeah, it, it, you know, I've got the winter outlook.